And it's about having an emotional intelligence and about thinking, well, how would I react? How would I feel if it was my house that had been destroyed by this earthquake? Um, how would I feel about my mother being in those ruins or my brother being in those ruins? And it's about translating because we're all human beings and we all, we all pretty much think the same way. Um, particularly in times of adversity and disaster. Um, and it's about trying to convey that sense of loss or pain or suffering that you know you would feel and getting that across to a viewer. And that's really quite important. It's, it's about not being dispassionate. I think that's where reporting can fall down a bit, um, where you're simply an outside observer. You know, you're someone with their nose pressed up against the glass rather than being on the other side of the glass. It's easy to carry people with you if you're on the other side of the glass rather than being outside. And as I say, the easiest way to do that is to put yourself in someone else's shoes. Imagine how awful it must be. And lines that I've used um, that, you know, I've, I've heard Jeremy Bowen or John Simpson use are, imagine your house imagine this was your house and as soon as you do that you bring the viewer with you and that viewer is behind the glass